Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Today is a slightly more sunny day. It is not profusely raining outside, but that doesn't mean that the entirety of the rest of the week is going to be rain. Oh, my poor bones. I get to suffer for the rest of the week. Now, I don't know if I'll actually get to the end of, of summer. I'm going to try to get into autumn. Um, remind me on the 28th. I need to get... I need to get the Junimo. The storm's approaching tomorrow. Where is... my chickens? Hello, chickens. So I have completely gone off of a uh, uh, schedule this week. Um, I don't know <laughs> if Stardew is going to take over this entire week. But I will at least probably play Pr uh, Princess Peach Showtime on, on Saturday. Your bones, what about mine? Been in bed for 24 hours? Been in bed for 24 hours and it's not gonna... It's not gonna hurt your bones all that much. You'll be fine. You'll be okay. You're gonna feel a little weak, but you'll be good. Here's my watering can. Now, since I have some of the fundamentals done, I'm going to get myself a well as soon as I have the money for it. <clears throat> if my voice sounds a little funky at times, I have been coughing a great amount uh, today. So my throat might be a little funky. I hope I get a gold, more gold star cord. I gotta actually plant more stuff there too. Your back feels like a, it's in a vice. I'm so sorry. Your hunt, your fever of a hundred degrees. Oh my goodness. Did you take medicine? Are you on a round of Tylenol? I think more so the reason why your you your your back feels like it's in a vice is because you're you're sick. Good, good, good. I'm glad. I'm glad that you're taking uh that you're taking medicine for that fever. I'm getting a well and I'm putting it right in this corner. It's Tuesday, so I don't think Robin's actually... I think she has her yoga class today. like sunflower seeds. Or no, who was it that liked sunflowers in general? Good. Oh wait, is some flowers in? Oh, some flowers is for the community bundle. I think that's the dye bundle. Probably. Need a. Need to get another mayonnaise machine. Do I have do I have stone? 
No, I don't have the little earth crystal. That's what I need. Also, another thing I should do is I want to try planting one of the mossy seeds. I think I'm going to uh, plant it next to the greenhouse. Because that's, I think that's also where I want to put my... Oh, there's still so much moss on the trees. That's where I think that I want to put my... Um... My mushroom logs. I think if I can get all these mushroom logs over here in a dense foresty area, I will also get a lot of, um... A lot of moss, too, because more trees around the, the mushroom logs, the more likely I'll get mushrooms. I'm gonna put that right there. Also, I read that, um... For each one moss that you get, it gives you one foraging experience. Which is pretty good. There's still so much. Remnants from the green rain that we had before. Oh my goodness. I am loaded with moss. I will probably never have to actually get moss again for an extended period of time. All oh, went into the water. Let's clear out Grandpa's statue. Grandpa's statue deserves to be seen. Second year or fifth year? Third year. Grandpa's coming back to meet us on our third year. We are barely into our first. I don't really change the trajectory of the chopping of trees so I don't get in the water. Oh, there's more moss. Oh my god. Did I not see, or is it just moss that immediately grew back onto these trees? I already have like 300 something moss. Oh no, nearly 300. That's another thing I need to make more tappers! smoke some more fish. Okay, let's go to... Oh, actually, it's about to close. We'll put that away and just go to the community center. Go down and get some more coal. I think I actually probably should try it. No, I'll get cold today and try to get further down the mines tomorrow.
Webs, if you have a fever of 100, and that's what it's like when you're already on a round of Tylenol, have you gone to the doctor to check to see if it's not just a normal cold? You might need to get antivirals. I just need a red cabbage and a duck feather. I think I need an updated, upgraded coop to get a duck. I think I also need to get... a rabbit, too. You're thinking about it? If you have health insurance, take advantage. Grapes. It is. Have I been this sick in ten years? That's a that's a good thing, but I'm also sorry that you that that you've gotten sick and have gotten rid of that ten year streak. But it would probably be a good idea to get it checked out. You wouldn't want that getting worse. Because usually if it's, if it's like the flu and you need antivirals for it, regular, regular like care and over-the-counter stuff is not really going to help you. So I hope that it's not that, but it's, it would be good to check it out. Completely up to you though. If you feel like you, you're on the mend, then disregard me. Oh yeah, that's right. I have the dust sprite thing too, but I don't think that... Well, I'll, I completely forgot about it, so I don't think I'm going to be able to get to... Who was it? Yeah, the wizard. I don't think he's going to talk to me after a certain point. It's already 7.30. If only it would have given me like the 20 dust sprites that we had that one time. If only I got lucky again with that. Then I would be abundant in coal and have gotten the quest done in time. No, thank you. Go away. I'm not here for you. Hey, carrot. Oh my God, stop touching me. Is that done? Maybe I should try. I don't think it'll work out, but maybe. And I got a little bit of coal out of it. Maybe the wizard doesn't have a time frame when you can't talk to him? Did you know that actually the Adventurer Guild doesn't close until 2 in the morning? Why would you be over there at 2 o'clock in the morning? I don't know, because then that's the time that you'd be passing out. Maybe it shouldn't be a good idea to walk down this way at this time. It's not like the forest is covered in, in moss anymore, so it's easier to navigate. Oh, 
okay, so I still can talk to him this late at night. Cool beans! That means I got a price ticket. The elementals are pleased with the job you did. Here's your payment as promised. Cool beans! I don't have to worry about that. And I got more money out of it. Good to know that I can talk to the wizard that late at night. Is my silo full? Let's see if I can add more hay to it. Cool, and I can still sell mayonnaise and the extra fish. Time to spare. Prize ticket on me. Some clothes. Add in there. My preserve jars going. Get rid of that one, that one. Extra money. I think it said it was gonna storm tomorrow. I don't have to worry about watering the crops. Oh, here it is! Mystery boxes can now be found. I think I found one in a tree once, so I think shaking trees as you pass by is a real good thing to do. Queen of Sauce rerun. Beautiful and sunny tomorrow. Pancakes. Yes, good. I've learned how to make pancakes. Hi, Wisp. You didn't miss much. I just got a little event uh, overnight. I can now find mystery boxes. I should also go put my ticket in the, in the vending machine in Mayor's house. Thank you, chickens, for the, the iridium eggs. I shouldn't have eaten popcorn before I started streaming. Now I feel like the, like the shells of the kernels are in my teeth. I'm gonna do an experiment. I'm gonna smoke one of the clams and sell the, a regular one and see what the difference in price is. why I hate popcorn. That's the thing is I really love popcorn. Popcorn is delicious. I have uh, like these little bags of the smart food white cheddar popcorn and I had it with my my the other half of my my subway sandwich. Um, But I always feel like I get like the the shells of the kernels stuck in my teeth like in my gums in the most inconvenient of places. And me, being a weirdo, um, I, I sometimes will run my tongue across my teeth and I can feel the little, the little, uh, pokey bits of it. So I have to, I get like a little bit compulsive to try to pull it back out. This is uncomfortable once I know it's there. Yeah, caramel popcorn. Caramel popcorn's good. 
uh, those, was it, Corna, it's not Cornucopia. There's, a, there's a brand that does little bags of, of, uh, sweet popcorn. It's like drizzled with chocolate. That is also really good. Also very delicious. We got a peach sapling. That's going to be for the greenhouse later. Oop. And oop. Oh. Glasses. It's Sam's birthday today. Let's figure out what to give Sam. Maybe. You know what? Let's go to let's go to the beach. See if we can find some coral to sell. Webs is currently laying there with a hundred degree Fahrenheit fever. Seaweed! Me. You ever have that giant can of popcorn with the three flavors of popcorn? Yes. Those are also hit or miss, though. Because sometimes, uh, those, those things can be, like, so delicious. And then there's other times that you will accidentally get one of the, the cans that has what tastes like styrofoam stale popcorn in it. It's very unfortunate because if you get the good can, it's so good. It's delicious. Okay. Let's go give the broken glasses to Evelyn. Just because. Okay, so you could just randomly continue giving them to her. That's interesting. Make sure you have tissues. Tissues and water. Bring some juice. Eat that soup. Okay, let's go down into the mine after I drop these off. Look at all the moss already! Goodness! I wonder if the tree's growing. I hope it is. A little bud of a tree right there. I hope that grows magnificently. Smoke one of these and then sell one regularly. Same condition. Let's see what the difference in price is. A train is passing by. Maybe I'll pop my head in there. Maybe they'll give me coal. Ooh, 
stone. Wood. Ooh, hardwood. at all these people on the train. Okay, now to go into the mine. Speaking of last stream, I was watching non-stop prog videos and I was texting my brother and going down the nostalgia road and he found an old VHS tape of Larry Boy and Veggie Tales. Aww. That's a good time. I got lots of those a lot at Christmas and when I was little and then my mom keeps the giant can and puts her pennies in them. She puts the pennies in the popcorn can? That's gotta be a heavy can. I would usually keep the can and put I think at some of them I put like sewing supplies in. Can't wait to get the other sword. This, this mine has not blessed me with a new sword. It sounds like when I get sick that I'm glad that I have some um, really big square... Well, actually, I think it's like a rectangle, but it's a big flat ice pack and they stay cold for hours as long as you're making sure that you're wrapping it up in some sort of towel because the condensation on the outside of the um of the ice pack can get really wet but those are so good in summer especially when i'm streaming or if i'm sick and i don't want to constantly be changing out ice packs I will have one of those and I will I will lay on top of it also really good if you have migraines too because then you can just put it on your pillow and you can lay your head on that as well sometimes it's good to keep the pennies because then you can uh, take it to either your bank or I think it's actually uh Less of a nuisance by doing the little machines they see around that you can dump coins in. There they are. Ooh, you can give me a way down. Oh, goodness. Too many bats. Oh, too much everything, goodness. Gonna die. I'm standing on top of me. Oh, my God. I hate slimes. Slimes are a nuisance. Video games. Life. I like slimes. Oh, 
Maybe I can at least get to level 65. cave carrot. Yeah, I don't think I've gotten really sick since you played Legends and I was scared to sleep because I could, could hardly breathe. Yeah. I I have gotten uh fairly sick since then because I think we were sick around the same time when uh when I was playing Arceus. But I think it I got sick in October. While I was house sitting, look at them all. And I think there's a separate time I got sick too. Before that, I also got super sick around that time frame. I don't think I've been too bad since then, other than migraines and then uh, body aches. Get a little scary because if you if you happen to actually not be breathing properly you can startle yourself awake uh due to the fact that since you're so sick and have such a buildup of mucus it can get really funky i know i've done that plenty of times and sometimes not even when i'm sick i have surmised that uh some of the reasons why i have uh, nausea in the morning is because I have some really funky allergies and I'm a constant mucus bucket which means I'm constantly producing it and it's going it's probably draining down the back of my throat and going into my stomach and then causing problems then too he's too lazy to get sick and somehow worse for it w no too lazy to get sick. Yep. Your brother probably just has a cast iron immune system. Lucky. I've had pneumonia more times than I can count. I've had, um... I've had the flu more times than I can count. I sell the clam. I gotta sell the clam real quick. There you go. Run. I've had one too many ear infections for a long period of time. Okay, so a clam will sell for 62 gold normally, and then it goes up to 125 when smoked. That's really good. That's really good. If you ask, he'll just say, yeah, just don't get sick, forehead. What kind, what kind of logic is that? Mildly perturbed. I wish I had the capabilities to say no to getting sick, but that's not, that's not a thing. That's not something that you can control. It's 
much as I wish that were the case. Oh, I have enough. I think that I have enough to get a well. He's a butt. He definitely is a butt. I'm glad that he doesn't get sick, though. That's a good thing, at least. <clears throat> there are times that I wish that I didn't have the immune system that I did, but I'm glad that it's not... I'm glad that it's not worse. Because I'd be so much more miserable than I already am. I guess that's a blessing in disguise. Music so cheerful. Chicken, 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 chicken. to refill my watering can yeah, I think that's what I'll do is I'm gonna go I'm gonna go get a, a well today make sure I don't accidentally smoke the sturgeon need that for later We have a lot of coffee that we can make later. Um, very nice. Don't think that I have. I've just just a little bit lower than what I need. the maple syrup so I need eight of that two maple syrup and wood or was it silver silver I'm gonna place that right there I should save one of these for the community bundle. Don't drink the hot pepper jelly. Don't do that. He's single, by the way. 
I'm just saying, just trying to be supportive, sister. Okay, I need... I think it's... I'm gonna bring clay, stone, and wood. I don't remember what's exactly needed for the... the well. For some reason, my lower tummy has decided to be a butthole. And hurt a little bit. Why? Why is it, why is it, if it's not one thing, it's another thing that causes problems. Why is she not here? I wish she would just tell me which day is that she's here. Dang it. What is it? It's supposed to be 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. So she's not even here. You have to wait until tomorrow. Well, let's go drop stuff up off at the community center. And then go look to see if there's any quests to do. This one should be for the artisan bundle. Uh, Robin's not at her shop, so I can't buy a well. Oh, that's all right. I should go check the fruit cave since we got it from Demetrius the other day. Is there a quest to do? Hi, Elliot. Oh dear, my shoes are filled with sand. And you only just noticed after walking away from the beach for an extended period of time? Sir. Slime hunter to slay 10 frost jellies in the frozen depths. I can do that. I can drop stuff off and then go back down into the mine. Oh, bye, mayor. Eat various things before I go down into the mine. Get my energy back up. Fine, I'll just wait. I love my cat. Get all these back for now. Bring the no, actually no, 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 no. Put that back. Why do I have hops in here? Potato. Let's bring the spice berries. Okay. Onward. All these times going into the mines, you can't just make a will for yourself. Yeah, you would think that I could, but I can't. I have to I have to have Robin do it for me. Robin has to build the mine for me, build the barn, upgrade my house. Well, some days she's nowhere to be seen, but no real set schedule other than sometimes she's there and sometimes she's not. Between nine and five. Just make a well forehead? I can't. It's not within the game mechanics. I would make a well in a heartbeat if I could do that myself. That's one slime. Ooh. I see 
Topaz. Oh my god, stop. Get out of here. Causing problems. It'd be cool if you could just make your own. Oh! That slime is out- that slime baby is out of bounds. What happened to the slime baby? There a way that you can walk out of bounds? There's a secret here? Oh, it's gone. He's dead. Ooh. There we go. We got some gold ore out of that. If a Skyrim horse can go up a mountain, you can make a well. <laughs> Slime baby door stuck. Stuck in wall, mother. I don't know how I got- Ooh, diamond! Ooh, two diamond! Out of here, bat. Gonna mine the diamond. Now I have two diamonds. I need to get the. I wonder where exactly again do you get the the crystal replicator? more slimes. Oh, thermal boots. One immunity. Are the sea urchins monsters? No, the sea urchins are just normal normal things that you can get on the beach. Sea urchin monsters? Grapes. The enemy I was just finding in the cave? Uh. Oh, no, those are. It, if you're talking about the little round. Uh. Little, the little black things, those were. Those were dust uh, sprites. Kind of like the, the soot sprites from. From, um. My neighbor Totoro. Or the soot sprites in um, Spirited Away. Kind of like that. I think that's what they're based off of or inspired off of. And this, these ones are just normal slimes. Take 
few more slimes. Yeah, it's a huge pouch of coal. I really kind of wish this led to somewhere. I like get out by midnight. Oh, diamond. Diamond. Get out of here. I'll sacrifice health for this diamond. There we go. shot. Gotta leave. It is midnight. Gotta get in the house. Gotta not pass out outside. As long as I get out by midnight and don't do anything else, I'll be completely fine. I say as I always grab the mayonnaise <laughs> on the way out. Nope, this time going straight for the house. Going straight to bed. Boop. Oh, I already pet the cat today. Yay! I can now make quality sprinklers and a cheese press. Ask for gems to appear in pairs. One plus ore per vein. Let's do. Yeah. Let's do geologist. I wish I could have more green rain. Sai so said that it's a one time thing in summer. I want it to happen more often. Clear and sunny tomorrow. Got geodes to process. Got to put that in there. Get one of the jades over. Get one of those over. The shoes in here. Yeah, I thought so too, but Sai so said it's one singular random event in, in summer. That you can get a lot of moss out of it, you can get the fiddlehead ferns from those... the fiddlehead fern trees. I might be able to buy a... well today. Our corn. We have four in total. I need one more. Just one more corn. I could go back 
Open side? Oh, I did. I want to eat the egg. Am I suddenly getting gold star eggs again? I thought my chickens were happy. Hungry for something spicy today? What's your what's your spice tolerance? Usually. Because if your spice tolerance is decent, I suggest Korean food. Of some sort. What spice tolerance? Spice tolerance is not calling certain condiments spicy. Bread is your spice tolerance? Oh my goodness. That's okay. I I just have happen to have a high spice tolerance, so Bread is your spice tolerance. Oh my goodness. Korean food level of spice tolerance is the ultimate spice tolerance. Okay, let's go up to Robins and hopefully she will actually be there. And then I can go over to Clint's. Maybe I should upgrade something again. Mm. No. Now I'm gonna get the well. And just go process some geodes. I would say Carolina Reaper, but um, I will be on the toilet all night. Yeah, that, that is the thing. Even if you have a spice tolerance, your butt does not. It'll suffer at some point. How much is a well? I thought. Oh, I thought a well was so much more expensive. What the heck? How did I think this was so much more expensive? Didn't I say this last time? Why do I keep thinking five thousand? What was five thousand? Fish pond. That's why. That's why. The slime hutch is the one that's the most expensive. Big coop. 10,400 400 wood 150 stone Barn 6,000 I don't know if I want to chop down that tree I will put it up there Sure, you'll be fine. Oh, what are you selling, by the way? Oh, it's a big chest recipe. I'll get a little bit more money and then get a calendar. Because I kind of want to get either the backpack or the dehydrator. I might want to do the dehydrator first. Hi, sea turtle. I wish Goron Spice was real. Yeah, Goron Spice... I don't know if it's... It'd be funny if it's not actually human edible and it's just crushed up lava rocks.
Process some geodes. Why rocks? I feel like you should get rocks just out of the geodes. I already have the ancient... Oh, yes. Thank you for two ancient drums. I already have those. Link eats it, so it's edible for Hylians. Link eats a lot of things that he shouldn't be eating. I don't know if that's a good reference. At least right now. I don't know if that's a good reference. Because he eats monster parts when he really shouldn't be eating monster parts. Hi, Mary Lewis. Don't mind me. Oh. Oh, that was close. Bye. I did not shift through the trash can. Sift, sift through the trash can. Oh, you butthole! You're in the way. That's okay. I'll just go this way and go look at the mayor's trash can. Now I'm going to have a well in two days and it's going to make my life so much easier. Did I take care of my chickens? I took care of my chickens. Those are non-fiction potions. A man crushes up fairies to make potions. I think that's also a concern. He puts pink fairies in a blender. That's something we can all be concerned about. Oh, I forgot to bring over my axe. I need to start building walkways soon. What? Oh, no. I put mayonnaise in there for a reason. Never mind. Don't, don't mind me. Peach, need I remind you your level 4 star tunic? <laughs> what it's made out of? She got reverted back? What happened with her was her time got reverted back thanks to Link. And anything that I that was taken off of her was completely reversed. That's also fiction. <laughs> uh-huh. 
Hey, you can't say that you didn't do the same thing. You gotta be- You gotta be able to fight off Ganon. You need the good armor. Otherwise, Ganon will one-shot you. She's not missing any teeth. We can all agree on that. I even buy the game. Oh, that's right. You keep talking about wanting to buy the game, but have not actually bought it yet. Did you... Did, you bought Princess Peach Showtime, though, right? Zelda's none the wiser. Saji, don't tell her what I did. It's fine. Though I think even if you did tell her, uh, with the, how s already self-sacrificing she is, I don't... She had no repercussions. There's no repercussions for taking horns, teeth, and what? Was it claws? I think it was claws. A lot. That is much more important. Always take care of your needs first. The needs. Needs over wants. The bees needs. Hi, Jack. deforesting the area? No. We're just cleaning it up a little bit. Just a smidge. Our washing machines broke uh, too, so we have to go to the laundry room. Oh, no! Oh, no. I hate that. That was like in uh our la our washing machine was broken for a good period of time, only finding out that it's not it wasn't truly broken. No, it was broken the first time and then we thought something else happened to it, but found out it was a little piece fell off outside the house. It was like in front of our house. I hate have, not having the convenience of the washing machine. Yeah. Oh god. Wait, microphone. I don't even know. Where's Alex? I don't even know what what you heard and what you didn't hear. Um, our wow, is it working? It's working. I think it is. This microphone, I swear. All of my equipment is dying. 
Um, I'm gonna take a clip of that and listen to that later. Maybe, maybe I'll hear what what exactly that the the microphone does. Um, what I was saying is that when our washing machine broke, it broke initially, put water all over the floor. And then it broke again, but it didn't actually break. A little bit just kind of like fell off on the outside of the barrel. So it was making some horrible noises when you used it. Thank goodness it's all fixed now. I hate ha not having a washing machine. The, mo the modern convenience. Yeah, I, I, I can only assume, like I said before, that the, the issue with this microphone right now is the cord the, that attaches to the microphone on the outside to attach it to the stand and to the XLR cord. I'm only assuming that that has twisted or broke in some way, but now I feel like it's only getting worse. I'm so, so annoying for a very expensive microphone to not last that long. Cause I feel like it should be more than five years that the, that something this expensive should last. I don't even think I've had it that long. And I don't think that this is something that can be repaired either, which makes me sad. I just need a new tube for the water. That's good at least. That's not like having to replace a washing machine. They're expensive? Boy. For a tube? That's unfortunate. I would think just the labor to install it would be on the more expensive side, not the tube itself. Or things of mayonnaise. <laughs> Going to be clear and sunny tomorrow. I'm gathering data on the correlation between soil and acolyte. Alkalinity and crop fructo fructose fructose. Long story. I need oh, you need the melon. That's right. Did I ever put a melon in the, the annual trout derby? Trout derby. That at the where is that happening? Where's the annual trout derby? That's new. I don't remember there being a trout derby before. break. Okay. I'll have to fix 
that. Should be able to... I've already kind of put saplings on this side, but I think I can put, just put an additional layer of saplings. is free from its tiny hat prison. <laughs> it is. The only thing I have is I don't have leaks. Oh, I do have leaks. I need horseradish? There. Oh, I burped. We'll do an inner and outer layer of saplings. The other one has broken. I don't know what this trout derby is, but I don't think I'm going to it today. Your what? My my low my volume is low. Maybe it's the mic. It's probably the microphone. What that fudge? I really, I'm really, I'm really worried about this microphone. I don't know if, if it's because it got broken in transit or whether or not I just got a faulty microphone at some point. I don't know. That's, that's good that it's better now. Um, which makes me debate. Do I, should I get the same microphone? Should I put that on my throne? That's what I have on there right now. But there, I think there's also a... A more expensive one that's also on there as well but I mean this microphone's good I just had to take care of it hopefully this one will last until that one off the throne gets bought boy did this other one break too? Good. What other one broke? I need to get rid of these trees from the outside. Flip a coin. One of them uh, is the same microphone that I have right now. And the other one is just a upgraded version of it, which I think it has a built-in preamp. But I already have like the cloud lifter and everything, so I don't know whether or not it's it's worth spending the or like putting effort for the extra money in there. I don't know.
two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. Now, as long as these guys always go back into their barn at night, or the coop, then they're fine. I don't think that I left gaps for them to be able to get out either. I'm just fully convinced I definitely that this microphone definitely got damaged. Which makes me very sad. The entire thing is kind of sad. Why is it always that when one thing breaks, more than one thing breaks? I don't have much as much of a savings as I did before. The move kind of, kind of took care of that. Yeah, technology can be kind of kind of funky at times. It's like it knows. They all they all have a conscience and they all know when one is breaking. Cause my We all know my mouse is a is a piece of poo right now. Due to X, Y, and Z reasons. Um the light on my door that I use to, sh uh, to show that I'm streaming croaked. Sai has replaced that. I have the new one up on the door right now, thankfully. I, I think I'm going to try to mess around with the old one and see if I can still get it to work. Um, my keyboard is functional. For the most part. And now the microphone. Or the microphone's been like that for a while. And it's only gotten worse! Hate it! I wish they didn't have a collective subconscious of a bee beehive mind. You gotta level your repair skills like them in The Sims. <laughs> Obia stabbed your mic in revenge? I hope not. I needed to be on my side. Okay, let's go give Demetrius the the melon and put the extra melon in the in the community center. I warned you to update, but no, I don't think it's not OBS's fault. I do need to update it though. But every time I think about updating it, it's like right before a stream, and I and then I just completely forget all of their. Was that Demetrius that I passed by? I forget to do it in between time frames. Like there's some things I want to change with my my layout and experiment in OBS, but I keep forgetting to do it until it's right before a stream because it's the only time that I ever think about OBS. <laughs> Uh It's my own my own fault. Should should we talk to Jack about raw water? Oh yeah, that's That's right. He brought that up the other. He brought that up yesterday. Uh Jack, what would you what would you think um is raw water? I just I want you to uh to elaborate me on that. I, I sort of have an understanding, but I want to I want to know what you think about it. Is there another Chow Derby tomorrow? Where is this Chow Derby? It's water. Yeah, it's just well, it's just water. Raw water. Water. Mineral water. 
Would you consider sparkling water tampered water or raw water? It's been tampered with. Where the heck would the trout derby be? Would it be in the forest? Probably. There's not trout in the ocean. I just call it, it is just sparkling water. Why are you all over here in the areas that I need to mess with trash cans? The sun is angry today. My skin is a bit too delicate, I'm afraid. Oh, this is probably where the derby was. And now it's long gone. Oh, it's still kind of going. It's the big day. I've got all of my equipment tuned uh, to catch trout. I don't even have annual trout derby. Welcome to the trout derby. What can I do for you? Explanation. During this event, rainbow trout have a chance of carrying a golden tag. If you find one, turn it in here for a prize. Okay. Okay, I guess. Is that a beaver? Of course, some guy shows up wearing the same outfit as me. How embarrassing. That looks... That doesn't look... The face doesn't look human. I guess I should go get my... These twins? Fishing sisters. We're the famous fishing sisters. Okay. It's 7 p.m. I don't know if, if I'll get anything, but let's go grab the fishing rod. Is rainwater considered raw water? I would consider rainwater raw water. Because bottled water is filtered water. Same with distilled water. That's also changed. So sparkling water would also be not raw water. I think. Yeah, unpurified water. It does hurt your brain. <laughs> Don't talk to the sisters unless you want to battle like Pokemon. <laughs> no, the the only thing that we're battling is a bout of trout. You mean like water from the sea or just stagnant water? That would be considered raw water. But I think stagnant water would be considered to be a different kind of water, too. Already. Flavored raw water. No. That's bacteria ridden water right there. Tent kit. Use this to deploy a one-time tent for sleeping. Can only be used outdoors. Oh, if I get stuck? I can use a tent kit? That's pretty neat. Watch all of these people disappear at a very specific time. Bacteria, mosquito, egg, ridden, ridden water. Stagnant water. Would that be the equivalent of chia seeds in the water? But it's mosquito eggs.
That's an awful thought. I, I, I shouldn't think about these things. That, that would be like the way that uh, <laughs> that Shrek eats food, but it's it's the equivalent of what would be human food, but by nature. Ew. Trout. Iridium trout. That actually sounds like a challenge mod in your game. No, I'm not modding my game. Speaking of Pokemon Jack, may, uh, someone made the most scariest mod. Someone made a ROM hack where you have to team battle against Cynthia Whitney. That's torturous. Rainbow Trout. One more time. I guess they're just going to be uh, fishing into the night. I'm leaving. Oh, Willie left, but those guys are still fishing. Goodness. At least I got a tent kit. That's cool. Maybe it's a one-time use kind of item. Gonna go into the community bundle. Oh wait, that in there. I'm after Tate. <laughs> ah, after taking care of the fencing for the chickens, I didn't actually take care of the chickens. Oh my god, I'm a moron. Yo, Whitney's milk tank is a pain in the butt. I'm a bad chicken parent. Once again. Oh, explain the tree fence? Yes, give me one moment. Lucky roll. So, the, um... Replacing the fence, because I thought the fence was going to, uh... Oh, it started breaking. There's more breakage. Um, I thought the fence was going to be permanent because it came with a farm. Uh, apparently not. It is still one of the items that will deteriorate over time, so you have to replace it. Like, the hardwood will last longer, but it will still deteriorate over time. By putting either, um lightning rods or tea saplings bushes i can make a makeshift fence for the chickens that will not break and i will also get resources out of it how do i do the summer spice berry grape and sweet pea I don't think I have grapes anymore. And I have no more leaks. Dang it. I'm 
probably gonna have to replace it with uh, wood for the time being until I can make more wild seeds. Also need you. <laughs> Bully Tendo, don't eat the wood. Nobody's eating wood here. Learned it the hard way because I did a nose log and find that it. Oh, that mill take is faster than Brayquaza? Will those trees grow if they're side by side? Yeah, it's it's just a little bush. So it'll grow like these crops right here. And it won't grow into a full tree. Other bit broke. Oh. This is just so that it contains the the uh, chickens in a, a predetermined area, so they don't get too far away from the barn, because they will die if they are not in the vicinity of the barn. They have to be able to get into the barn at night, so other animals won't attack them. This is an animal crossing. The tree will grow next to the bush. Yeah, the, if you you can't have a tree like directly next to another tree, but oh, see, it's like slowly deteriorating as it goes along. I think these ones I can probably get rid of. These are fine. I just gotta get more tea saplings so I can have two layers of tea saplings right here. Cause I've already put them right there. And I don't want to cover up my my walking space. The only thing that you still need is that you're you're still gonna have to have a little bit of wood fence that you're gonna have to replace every once in a while, just so you can have the gate to go in and out of. But other than that, having the saplings is a good way to have um to have a makeshift fence that doesn't break. Okay, now I can water my plants. So as you can see, the, uh, these ones are not directly next to the tree, but they will. These ones will still grow, but if it's the like side by side, they won't grow properly. I think, or I could be wrong because those ones are also next to the tree and still growing. Maybe they only grow a certain amount. I'm not too sure. Experiment. We can leave the tree there and find out. Oh, the well's there! Good, 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 good. I don't have to worry about walking over to the chickens to get more water. Well. Let's hope that... We don't ever have a horror moment with the... with the well. Yeah, 
It's the ring well. No. I just said no. Oops. Get that back. I will take these ones. Put those in there. Okay. I can put you back. And we can go back to fishing. Jack beat me to it. I hope that I never play a game where something crawls out of the well. I have to catch up on Chilla art games. One of the more recent Chilla art games is kind of like a observation duty type. What I need to do is emulate a PS1 game. A PS1 horror game. Wasn't there a uh, Sadako the Ring kind of game uh, on the Switch at one point? Not the Switch, the, the Wii. You kind of went around a hospital and the, the, the cats, the, the cat screaming child was in there. Even... No, it was not Fatal Frame. Fatal Frame is on PlayStation, though. What the heck fish is this? Dorado? Fierce carnivore with brilliant orange scales. I don't remember this fish. Yeah, the grudge. There you go. I think that was on the Wii. in the near future that we'll get more older Nintendo games. I know that there will still be some games that will never probably see the light of day again. Um, but at least hope that we can get some Wii games or some more N64 and things like that. What was the first Fatal Frame mod? Was that PlayStation 2? A lot of really great horror games that came out on the PlayStation. They are horribly expensive to get now, though. I 
I tried looking up an emulator for that. Um, there are like several of them. I don't know which one's even okay. Maybe I will consult Sai because I know that they have. I think they have um, the randomizers for for like a link to the past. Did you know there's one of those on the Google Play Store as well? A couple of different emulators. It has like the base emulator, but you gotta get the, the files for the games themselves. What is considered to be more frowned upon? Having a emulator or having a modified system? Hello, hello, hello. Yeah, I have my... My sale is free today. No hat to cover them today. Free snail is a happy snail. <laughs> Oh, I don't know if she's going to disappear yet, but let's double double check. She might disappear at 7 or 8. Oh, she's still here. It might be 8 o'clock. Stepping stone path. Pomegranate sapling. Oh, I can take the lobster. Oh, duck feather. More tea saplings. Vanilla Villa. A rare seed too. Beet. Cool. I can go put those in the community bundle. There's some Twitch, uh, Twitch streamers that you follow that use them. Third thing to be frowned upon selling an old video game for a high price. Yeah, scalpers. Yep, 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 yep. I think some of them are some of them are a little bit justified because I think Rule of Rose only had like a limited amount that was made, so I can understand the price for it for that one. Or maybe that was haunting grounds or haunted grounds. Haunting haunted grounds? Haunting? $500 for Path of Radiance? Ew. Every physical game has a limited amount. That is true. But I know that there are certain ones that had a lot less than, um, than others. And I think Fire Emblem Awakening was one of them because that's the same time frame that Animal Crossing New Leaf came out. And they used a lot more of the cart or like the the blank cartridges for Animal Crossing that they did Fire Emblem Awakening. I 
That's how I got that one digitally downloaded instead of being able to buy the, uh, uh, the physical cartridge. Yeah, ha hunting, hunting grounds has, is one of those more, uh, dubious kind of stories. Not for the faint hearted. That's for sure. Same thing with Rule of Rose. That is also another horror game that not everyone should be playing. You you need you need a strong mental state for those two. I think there was another one that was the same people who did either Haunting Grounds or Rule of Rose. I think it was like Clockwork something. Which is also equally as disturbing. Ooh, we got some emerald. Three mystery boxes. Yeah, clock tower. There you go. There's still a lot of games that I would love to see remakes of. Um, like Ark the Lad would be another one. There's, I think there's one called Dark or Darkstone. No, not Dark. There's, I would like a a Darkstone remake, which is a like a little dungeon crawler game, which I don't think we'll ever get enough or ever ever have one. It was, I think it's like an old CD game. I don't remember what it was called. There was a PlayStation game, but I don't remember if it was actually called Darkstone or if it was called something else. That was also another neat game. Don't play House of Bellas. They have very brutal deaths in that game. Ugh. Oh, it's gonna be in the mystery boxes. Gotta crack them open like geodes. And go to Clint tomorrow's. Yeah, dungeon color games are really fun, and they did actually uh port Darkstone onto Steam, but you have to heavily modify it or mod it in general. Because it will not play at proper resolution. It'll open up in the tiniest screen and you can't even play it even if you mess with the Steam settings itself. You have to mess with the actual game. Which is kind of disappointing. Because I bought that game. Because I love Darkstone so much. Yeah, it's okay though. I'll I'll probably at some point figure out what I want to do with it, but I I I've been playing other games, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, was I putting away the rare seed? Is my door to the... Yeah, it's closed. Oh, Pokemon... Pokemon Mystery Dungeon? That... That's a fun dungeon crawler game. Bait maker, spinner, trap bobber, sonar bobber. 
remember the sonar bobber. If you could hear the, the clacking sound of the, the ice in my cup, sorry. Wild honey. Pokemon Ranger was actually a really fun game. I think that I should at some point look at all the DS games that I have in a little baggie. I think some of them would be kind of difficult to emulate, especially uh, ones that have a lot of utilization of the... of the, um, the screen. Or maybe I could be wrong because then you just have the mouse and then it's not a big deal. There was an old Digimon game. I like that it was a, similar to Smash Bros, but you collected orbs. I think that was um, Digimon Arena. Or maybe that was a two... A two um, versus game. Digimon Arena. Maybe that one's different. I think um, Digimon Arena was more like Street Fighter. Digimon Spirit. See, th the games that I would definitely want to emulate is Hamtaro games. And the first Digimon game because I can't find my copy. I can't find the CD of it anywhere. I can't figure out where it got put. And it makes me sad. Uh, grab the extra diamond, put that in the center museum yeah digimon world was you were dropped into the digital world like like any of the other animes or games and you have a partner that you that you train and grow, you feed them and everything. They they have to go poop and there's various uh it's kinda like a Tamagotchi game, but like a little more open worlded with seg segmented worlds really. Um and you can have the <laughs> you can have the issue of if you don't poop at a bathroom, you can get a new Mamon. But you you uh, go around and unlock new areas, rebuild bridges and things like that, broken uh, places, bring Digimon back to the village. You're basically making the village better. 
And when you bring home certain Digimon to improve the village, it improves your, your, like, your food, what you get to shop for, and all that kind of stuff. It was a really fun game. And I loved the first Digimon World the most, but Digimon World 2 and 3 were also very fun. Cyber Sleuth is, is bled to me. One of my friends was playing it and they liked it. Um, I don't think that I would ever play it. Oh, mystery box. Did Mc, uh, McDonald's have a Tamagotchi toy? I think that they did at some point. Or maybe that could have been uh, Burger King. I don't really remember which... Uh, which fast food chain had the superior toys? Because usually McDonald's and Burger King um, were pretty on par with each other back then. So I think it was Burger King that had the uh, the really nice Pokeballs that had the golden plates in it. Those were some really nice, um, really nice toys. Back in the early 2000s. Pine cone? Who threw away a pine cone? Yeah, I don't feel like the toys are as good as they... They have good toys, but they, they weren't as sophisticated and had a thought process to it as it did back then. I feel like they were a lot nicer. Ooh, hardwood. Ooh, we got some chowder. Definitely McDonald's, but Burger King had more polished toys like the Pokemon Gold Medal Pokeballs. Yes, yeah, yeah. I still have a couple of those. One of them is kind of rusty though, which which also makes me sad. Um, but I think those those Pokeballs, they weren't really sturdy, so they broke kind of easily. Jade Hills. Actually, Dairy Queen had more sponsored toys than Burger King and McDonald's combined. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think it's probably because Burger King was usually... Like, Burger King and McDonald's were the go-to when it came to, uh, to fast food. Because I always associate Dairy Queen with just getting ice cream. Even though they did have food. Or I think they do sort of have food. But mostly it's mostly it's ice cream. I think I talked about it before. But one of the more memorable... Um collaborations that they had with Burger King was the Simpsons during Halloween and they had the the purple slushies ices and then I think some of the food was also dark in color like I think it was like a black burger bun or something um turns your tongue completely like either black or purple and then you find out that you're peeing purple later <laughs> due to the due to the either I think it was either the icy or the black bun Maybe, I think it was definitely the IC that did that. I think McDonald's had something like that as well. At one point. Yeah, the Halloween bucket. Ah, putt. Red snapper. Sturgeon. I need to get an extra sturgeon. Do 
duck feather for the bulletin board. Just need the red cabbage. And that's good. Honey. Oh, I should go back and check the cave. I'm gonna put these crab pots down in the ocean first. Who was it that had the green ketchups? That was Shrek. I think it it was both green and purple advertised uh, Heinz ketchup bottles for Shrek at the time. I'm from Argentina. I don't understand English, but I do know how to, to write. Can you? I don't know if you speak Spanish. Please at least say hello. Hi, hi. I I sadly do not speak uh, Spanish. My my apologies. It was actually kind of interesting the the amount of as or advertising that Shrek had back in the day because there was a lot of uh, Shrek themed items. There was ketchup. I think there was there was a TV at one point that was Shrek. Shrek really was popular. I think I remember having the um the ketchup at least once. It was just sort of a fun thing to mess with just to see uh what it if they if it tasted any different. It was just dye filled. Dye filled ketchup. Oh, I said I was going to put the crab pots in the ocean. I don't currently have bait to put in it right now, but I will grab that later. Yeah, there are things that I never thought would become Lego games. Or or franchises that would somehow become something sort of Lego. Ooh, cave carry. Like, I didn't think that there would be Lego... Batman games or Spider-Man games or did they do like a Lord of the Rings Legos stuff? I don't know. It's kind of all over the place. Or Mega Bloks still a thing? Uh, last time that I went to a toy section, I remember seeing uh, the, the kids version of, of Blocks. So I'm pretty sure that those are still a thing. Is it? Is it not? I don't think it's growing over here. I don't know how to grow it. I don't know how to grow the moss seeds. I left that thing there for forever and it's not growing at all. Maybe it can't grow exactly right there. Maybe I should take down one of the trees and try to replant it. Maybe it needs more space. Yeah, Lego Star Wars. <laughs> Another interesting one, but I didn't think that it would become a, a Lego themed thing. my phone vibrating oh no it's Instagram
You know, it's funny uh, when you mainly use Instagram to relay several thousand memes to friends and then it's like a few days later that they, they start looking and replying to them. <laughs> Oh, the chowder is a fishing. That over there with the fishing stuff. Fishing upgrade. There and that, yeah. And then we'll put these in the other chest. Creepy crawlers and easy bake. Yeah, th I think... I don't think that there's actually a lot of toys anymore that are food or candy oriented. Um, They have that a lot more in Japan than they do in the U.S. Oh my goodness. Maybe I should turn my phone on silent and not vibrate. For now. Yeah, gummy bugs. Easy bake oven. There was ones that you would make, what, candy dirt, candy uh, gummy worms. Um, I think there was something else that go went along the lines of that too. There was like candy slime that you could make. I don't know if those are actually a thing anymore. If they do do those. I'm going to have to get going. See you later, Jack. Take care of yourself. You're also sick. Definitely take care of yourself. Be Make sure to drink lots of water. Drink some juice. Get some vitamin C in you. Feel better. I think you would get a pretty penny for selling uh, Lego Star Wars stuff if they're in good condition. If you don't ever plan to really use them yourself anymore. Rest well, feel better. I'm waiting for the the pollen to hit me like a freight train. There's already a lot of flowers outside. A lot of the trees have some really pretty flowers on them. Um, but I'm afraid of the fact that there is a possibility that I will uh, be suffering pretty soon. I need to change the filter in my, my air purifier. <laughs> I have that and I've had that for a while and just have not done it because I'm s too lazy. I have allergies galore. Dust makes me sneeze and be really itchy. Um pollen's a funky thing. I don't have as much of an issue like touching or laying on grass, but I will still get it pretty itchy with that too. I don't know what I'm officially allergic to, but I know what my body hates in general. <laughs> Thanks, Paul. And done, done. Any extra trees? Snack. 
Yeah, it's kind of awful to have uh, uh, allergies because every morning is uh, is a chore. Getting up and uh, like eating food, drinking something warm uh, causes like the start of drainage and it's just, it's not fun to deal with. Cause then you're hacking up a lung. Your tonsils get angry because you're constantly coughing. You have to clear your throat too, one too many times. And from what I've learned, that's also really bad for your throat. And people have equated to somebody like doing the motion of clearing out their throat is the same thing as what, gargling razor blades or something for your vocal cords. But I can't necessarily stop because nothing nothing truly works. I've tried nasal sprays. I've tried allergy pills. I've tried uh, just drinking tea on a constant. It doesn't feel like it works. Suffering. Suffering as always. I think the only thing that I never want to try doing is the, uh, what's it? The distilled water with the, with the powder that you put in it and then you pour literally into your nasal cavity, the, wa uh, the, the, the distilled water. Because I don't like the thought process of if I do it wrong, something can go horribly wrong within my sinuses. And I don't like the feeling of wanting to pour water in my nose. Yeah, the, the nasal sprays I kind of hate too because they, they, they tend to, even if I'm being as gentle as possible, it always feels like it goes down my throat. But you have to, you have to stay like bent over the sink. And some people say it's like, oh, if it's dripping out your nose, you're not getting the full, like, medication. But I, I'm trying to also to not swallow the medication. <laughs> I can't win. I, no raw water. No, don't put raw water in your sinuses. That's not good for you. That can lead you to getting very sick. Very quickly, getting sinus infections, which is also not fun. I've had one too many of those, too. Sai has uh, dubbed me as a delicate orchid. Um, and orchids are notoriously uh, famous for dying if you don't take care of them in very specific ways. You water them, they die. You put them in the sun, they die. <laughs> I do certain things out of the ordinary, I die. Be sure to cook your water thoroughly before placing it in your nose and at full temperature. Because then you're going to burn your sinuses. Imagine getting... Any degree burns in your sinuses. You're not going to be able to put topical cream on that. That would not be fun at all. Come by the shop and check out the new bras I'm selling. They're the best money can buy. And you can customize them with different kinds of tackle. Hope to see you soon, Willie. He has new fishing rods in stock. Is it not ready to harvest yet? I think that's why sometimes I'll have minor headaches and then certain times... Certain times of the year that I'll have full full on migraines. Because those are occasional. Those don't happen all the time and sometimes they'll last for a few days. 
but I think uh, having like the normal like pressure in your head is probably due to sinus pressure. I'm trying not to pick these. What the heck? She's a fragile peach. We've talked about this before. Like, I want to hug you, but I'll probably get you sick somehow. <laughs> but that's a that's a that's a big possibility. This is why my friends and my family will always, um will always make uh, jokes about that they need to get me a hazmat suit before interacting with me. <laughs> How could a snail be so fragile? I have no idea. Have you seen a snail without its shell so squishy? Yeah, there you go. I'm a, I'm a snail without a shell and I can't... And I can't, I can't find a good suitable uh, shell for me. Which means I'll get sick. I'm in the rain all the time. Sometimes you get headaches because you're stubborn of reasonings you know why. That's not the entire reason why I get headaches. To top it all off, I also have insomnia. Which will add to the getting sick. Because the less you sleep, the less your immune system is working. And I already have not the best immune system, but it's, it's I guess it's decent enough that I have not died, so. <laughs> or had hospitalization for it, other than, I don't know, just going to the hospital for pneumonias. I can say that I do not have pristine lungs. Each uses shell smash. Her defense has been lowered. <laughs> uh, the it's it's so unfortunate having a uh, a non fully functioning immune system. Not that I've ever had any sort of like official like diagnosis with it or anything. I just know uh, due to the fact that I get sick so much. Is kind of an indicator. But I don't think it's anything entirely serious. I think. Well, like I said, not hospitalization uh, levels of, of danger. It just kind of affects your, your daily life, which is also very annoying. There's not really much I can do about that other than attempting to uh, do certain things to take care of it. Like, I don't know, taking vitamins and attempting to go out into the sun, which I don't normally do. But, you know. Let's go check the cave. Not sleeping again reasoning. Yeah, it's it's one one of many reasons. Peach. Jerry. Oh, this is this is a good haul of fruit. And put the cherry in there, the peach in there, the orange. Ah, the plum is a part of that too. Keep those. Put all these away. And there. All of these ones are going to go into the community center. Can I put lights around the cave entrance? I, oh, I did. Okay. I'm going to put an additional light over there. I 
have you not gotten you haven't gotten something to eat yet? You need to eat something, Wisp. Eat food. the cheese press yet. Okay. Bait. Place a fish inside to create targeted bait. Oh, cool. Oh, I should make some of the mushroom logs. Or more, more of the mushroom logs. Did I even place any of them down? Did I have one? Oh, I don't think I've actually made any yet. Cool. Okay. Put that back away. I'm gonna go put this by our greenhouse. Yeah, I got one one beehive. I need more need more maple. Oh, you're referencing a video? That's another thing. I'm not very up to date with memes. Other than the sturgeon. Okay, you. Eh. I can always get more sturgeon. I'll put those in the community bundle as well. I think the if I put the sturgeon in, I'll finish a bundle. I don't know what you guys are talking about. I don't know what video that is. Okay, Peach, science time. Are you going to Bill Nye the science guy me? Search. The more you know, that's the only space desk I know. The the history of the entire world, I guess. You know, the thing is, I'm still confused because I may or may not actually know that. But since my brain is already working at multitasking, I probably don't even. I probably don't even remember. Okay, so now I just need apricot, apple, goat cheese, cheese, pomegranate. Okay. Should be able to finish that soon. Oh, I can finish that soon too. Construction bundle needs 10. I could probably just put one of the oak resins in there. 
let's do one of the vault bundles. 2,500 chocolate cake. Chocolate cake that I'll probably never use. Maybe the chocolate cake would just be used in the in the skull caverns when I finally go down in there. Protons and no neutrons. Is it just an old science? Is it an old science show or or are you is it somebody on YouTube doing sciencey things that I don't recall? Oh grapes, good, good, good. I can make more more seeds with this. Saw the moss over here too. You get gas. <laughs> Don't ask me to think about science. It's a video from Bill Wirtz. I absolutely have no clue who that man is. That's probably just one not a video that I remember watching. Oh, I hate skeletons. Not the tooth gas? No, yeah, I know not the tooth gas. Yeah, the skeletons will still hit you even if you're hitting them because they'll still for some reason decide to throw bones at you. See, when you talk about science, the main thing that I think about is Bill Nye the Science Guy. Specifically. But is it is Bill... Hold on. Am I, about, am I about to feel stupid? No. Okay, no, I have not seen this person before. Never mind. No, I have not seen that video. I have not seen that man's face before. Ooh, an amethyst. I don't even remember what the bone fragments are for, for the skeletons. I'm to watch it? No, I'm not watching it right now. I mean, Stardew. Door scroll three. What, 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 what? If you want to learn history but have ADHD, it's the video for you.
I feel like maybe uh, back in the day for a lot of people, that's the reason why Bill and I, the science guy, and magic, uh, the magic school bus were such a good way to learn things. Because it made it fun for the people. You freaking bone throwing skeletons. Where do you get all the extra bones? I'm just gonna go down the level. As much as school bus is high energy and so is Bill Nye the science guy. They also had a... Uh, I think there's two two CD games for Bill Nye the Science Guy, or Bill Nye the Science Guy and Magic School Bus as well. Those were also on par learning games back in the day with Reader Rapid and Math Blaster. vaguely remember the magic school bus now just remember that the meme of the kid took off yeah the helmet in space and he died yeah there's a lot of memes from um from the magic school bus with miss frizzle and the living bus because i think there is one where they were i don't remember if it was a digestive track or something that that turned into a lot of beams as well I can also sort of vaguely hear the uh, the theme for the Magic School Bus in my head, but the entirety of the lyrics are more like a mishmash of noise rather than me entirely remembering the actual lyrics for it, which is kind of irritating. There's one bit that I just remember is like cruising down the main street. But I can hear the lyrics jumbled in my head, but I can hear the tone to it. I should leave. We're at 76. I need to get to level 80. Yeah, some of the, the funner stuff with the CD game of uh, the Magic School Bus is learning about the deep ocean and... I think there is space bits too. Miss Frizzle always dressed to the occasion. I should upgrade another tool. Wrong one. Why does it say that what there was? Beautiful and sunny. Yeah. 
you've seen the magic school bus that go into a human body feels very on brand for the show yeah i don't even remember whose body that they went into to to learn about anatomy thanks to the kids show shenanigans he was perfectly fine after they thought him out I think I remember hating him because he didn't like the field trips that they wanted to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't remember his name either, but... Oh, crap. It's so funny that I can only really remember Miss Frizzle. Yeah, imagine. I'm going to have this... I'm going to have this whole room filled with Junimos. We're getting closer to the 28th. Four more days and I can go get another Junimo plushie. Because apparently they come in different colors. I'm gonna fill the room with them. A storm is approaching tomorrow. Oh, I should. That means I should make some. I should make some lightning rods. Iron bars. I wish I knew how to uh to to water these without picking them. Oy vey. Other than the the sprinklers. should have set the, the sprinkler behind the or in front or behind of the 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 beehive I don't know why my brain was deciding to take so long to say that goes away guys down real quick. I'm gonna put one of them a couple of them in here for keeping the grass in place. Where'd my chicken go? One chicken? Two chicken? Happen. I wonder if you can still, uh, I'm at, uh wait, 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 wait. I'm pretty sure that you can still get them because it's just in the bush up above the park. So I don't think that it messes. I don't think the getting the warehouse messes with that bush there. Don't talk to me about plushies. Blame blame me. Why blame me? Marie. Oh, you've become the Marie meme. Which one? Which one? Which which plushie was it that you got? I can't even recall. Now it's growing. We just need more room. I don't remember which plushie it was. Was this the Sfeel plushie? Yes. Sfeel. 
Hey, you got the the feel plushie for your wife. It's like ah, me and me, my wife, and their <laughs> and their so and so size feel plushie. Did I do I have enough gold melons now? Yes. Good, 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 good. I think I have enough old star corn too. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Sweet pea, spiceberry grape. chickens happy chickens happy eggs good mayonnaise Peach said I couldn't buy it buy it i could but i'll lose cuddling privileges no i said that you could you just have to be the the bigger spoon because the the spiel is the little spoon the littlest spoon you just got to get up there and 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 cuddle that way triple spoon Technically, if you've already bought it, I can't say anything else. I think I only discouraged you from buying it is because you said you had other things that you needed to do first. You gotta improvise with the cuddling. If Pam has decided to be the big spoon with the spiel, you have to be the bigger spoon. The biggest spoon. I also don't think that you can t uh, that you can say much because you also have pregnancy pillows. And that's also a cuddle hinderer. It's most definitely a cuddle hinderer. I should upgrade the tools. Yeah, I have 11,000. I could un upgrade. I should upgrade my pickaxe. Hi, Sai. Sai, are you awake from a nap or are you wanting to nap is what that emote means. I don't, I don't mean to be, I don't mean to point out the things that are going on there, Wisp. I'm just saying. Pre I have two sets of pregnancy pillows, so I can't, I can't really say much either because I also have it to where I, I couldn't cuddle even if I had the room to cuddle. Okay, cool. Now I just need, I just need the five gold star pumpkins and then I'll then I'll have the greenhouse set up done nearly I just need apple apricot or pomegranate from the cave and then the animal bundle I'll have to be diligent and get a barn soon you 
feel awful? No, I'm not pregnant. I just like to sleep on my side and pregnancy pillows are a godsend. I have two different styles of pregnancy pillows. They're just very comfortable. <laughs> I'm sorry you don't feel good. Yeah, they're very nice pillows. They're so comfortable to sleep with. If you are a side sleeper, I highly recommend. Even like slightly like sleeping on your stomach, I highly recommend getting a pregnancy pillow. They that's just what they're called. That's what they're meant for. That's what they were designed and built for. And you have to be a side sleeper when you're pregnant, but in general, I just sleep on my side in the fetal position, so it's it's mine. It's it's a it's a given that I will utilize it that way. You want to write, but you want to sneep. Why don't you? Why don't you write the equivalent of a page, and then go sneep, and then go take a nap. Mm. You know what? I could also get the dehydrator. I think I'm gonna do that first. I'm gonna go I'm gonna go grab the dehydrator recipe. What is with you when I ever I talk about my pregnancy pillow? You're always talking about pregnant and that. <laughs> it was it that recommended them to buy it? No no no. I had one before you even talked about recommending me one, I believe. It is an internet classic. Oh, I can't buy it on Wednesdays. I'll wait. I'll be patient. All of the 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 Yahoo questions. No, I've seen I've seen the pregnant. Can you get pregnant? Pregnant. Uh, pregnant. I've also seen the, the Luigi board ones. You need to rewash that pillow? Yeah, you had pillow on the brain. It's fine. It's okay to be momentarily um, disoriented because you're thinking about pillows. You can't expect Grandma Peach to have a a specific grasp on the um on the memes. <laughs> I d I do not have the the uh best knowledge when it comes to memes. Certain ones I know. I I do not know the majority though. History of the world is next on the list by the sounds of it. I've heard of that, but I just never watched it. I'm I'm pretty sure that I've heard of it. No, I'm definitely not well versed in meme culture. I will occasionally come across um memes every once in a while, or somebody will tell me about the memes. In addition to the there is words that has terms that I knew of before, but now they're being now they're being taken and put into different contexts now. I think recently I've learned that the word yeet 
uh, Y-E-E-T, which used to mean, like, throwing something really far, has changed into a different uh, definition now. That there's another definition to yeet, which I think is... Um... Oh god, I don't even remember what they said that it was now. But they ch so the, the, the newer generation has changed it into something else. Yeah, I didn't know that either until one of my, my friends uh, made mention of it. I am also equally as confused. I know that uh, the languages change a lot over generations and then a lot of words that didn't have certain definitions before that have definitions now. But I think that's usually like the general vocabulary that's normal words that you get out of the dictionary not the the made up words like yeet being changed into something else if you're if you're gonna change it into something different i think you just need an entirely new new word don't take other words and make the rest of us confused yeet before yeet was a vegetable no i thought beet Eats a vegetable? Hold on. Is he a vegetable? Yeet at your vegetables? No. What? Hold on. No, that now that just looks like another meme. What the heck is a yeet? No, now these are people are just having videos of throwing vegetables around. I'm no, I don't think that's a vegetable. Them whippersnappers, uh, whippersnappers with their raisin gats. The, that's the thing is, I didn't understand what a gat was either. I understand the word riz, but not not gat at at first. Peach, you gullible snail. <laughs> I'm confused. I'm sorry. What? Did I did I fall for the joke? Of yeet was a vegetable. You can't do this to grandma. Grandma doesn't have the brain cells for this anymore. How dare you do this to me? After my three days of migraines and my IQ is already low. You took advantage of my low IQ. Be nice to peace. She's a granny. Exactly. I talk. Do you, do you not get that from how I talk about my aches and pains? On the daily? <laughs> my brain cells have been... My brain cells and my IQ have been going through three days of migraine. I don't think that you should be testing me. I've been abused. I've been abused and teased. not wearing the hat lets out the brain cells is that why you see most elderly wearing hats is because they're trying to keep the rest of the brain cells that they have left inside of their head should i be wearing a hat all the time just because i'm an elf doesn't mean that elderly age doesn't hit me at some point <laughs> hey, 
It's time to sleep. It's time to take that nap. Eepy. Goodbye, Sai Eepy. I hope you have a good nap. I don't want to deal with these at the same time. Hate you, ghost. Hate you. <laughs> Stop throwing some bones at me. Oh, God. oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh god. Oh goodness. Oh, look, I am actually going to have to use the chocolate cake. Whoop! Delicious chocolate cake to save my life. I can't wait to make, be able to make a chocolate cake. Oh, thank goodness. Times where I wish Pokemon was real and just to hire a hip, uh, hypno for melatonin. See, you say stay away from the hypno, but if it's your own hypno, like your own caught hypno. Wouldn't it be not as bad? What if, what if you just got a, a jump luff and had it use a uh, sleep powder like Sandman? Give me a staircase. Yeah, any sort of uh, grass type Pokemon, you can probably get it to just. Give me this real quick. Then I'm leaving. Goodbye. Uh, oh, gotta go. No, we don't talk about Vaporeon in this house. Specific Pokemon we do not talk about in this house. You can actually think about Pokemon in a lot of practical uses uh, with like the Larvitar that we or was it Larvitar? No. Magmar? Mag Mag Magby? Mag something? No, Slugma. How Slugma was used to basically heat a house. I thought I think that kind of concept is really nice and cute. The idea of being able to use Pokemon in practicality is really neat. And I think that's a that's a concept I would um that's a concept I would explore for like you could have like a a boutique or a uh what's it? Like you could probably use Pokemon for um uh, for medical purposes as well, because like those those that can learn like sleep powder, per uh, like the sport was <coughs> it it's paralysis spore or something? Just paralyze.
Healing pulse? Yeah, 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 yeah. I can make a loom! I need to make a barn. Imagine if you have an Abra and just use teleport to another state. Does, do you, does he need a passport? I think there would be different kind of rules for that as well. Traveling between places. Another storm is approaching. Uh, my knee's acting up again, and you know what helps? Oh, hot pepper. I can do that. Pepper. We'll give him a gold star pepper. Ooh, we got pine tar. Yeah, there's a lot of practical uses for things and I think it's uh I always think it's a really neat concept for that and I hope that they do more content like that in the future um with some of the videos that they do for the the Pokemon channel. need to make a lot more saplings once I figure out where I want to put the barn. Oh, look, we can get tea leaves now. the Pokemon for evil. Imagine you go to a 7-Eleven and an 11-year-old has a god. <laughs> Sorry. It brings Arceus to 7-Eleven. Okay. That's done for now. Oh, two of them have already been used. Getting a back massage from a Machamp might break your spine. In, I think. I think there's a high possibility that that would happen. Did I put the tent in here by accident? I did. Why did I do that? Oh, maybe it's because the shape. I thought it was a seed. put these in here for now until I decide where I want to put the barn. Oh, I do think that you can use some fighter style Pokemon to utilize them for um to utilize them like a masseuse or just initial construction. Anything else that I can bring over? Should check the cave before I leave. Oh yeah, that's right. I need burglar corn for this too. Winter foraging bundle. It's not until later. 
I'll have to finish that one. Construction bundle. I can bring over 10 hardwood. bundle needs the maple syrup. I'm going to utilize the maple syrup for the other bundle. Oak. Wine. Later. <gasps> you got the apple. Apples also for the artisan bundles. So I can finish that too. Cool. Since I have, yeah, I can go to I can go to Pierre's now and get. I can get the um the dehydrator now. Yeah, you would have a lot of of stories with the Drifloon. Imagine also the tragedy that you would get. Um, is it? This is one of the more morbid ones because you know, you know the the uh, story behind Phantom, right? If you have a kid that's lost in the forest and you spot a Phantom. Uh Slate 10 skeletons? 1,000 gold? I can do that. I'll go into the mines after this. Yeah, that'd be one of the more awful things to see. Because you have a search party that's going into the woods to look for, for them, but you find the phantom instead. I wonder if there is ever. I wonder if there is ever an indicator, uh, of differences between phantoms. I have a big bear plushie. Yeah, you won't be able to tell. I wonder, it's like, it would be disheartening, but I think you would still do the search because you wouldn't be sure if it's a, if it's a, a recently uh, turned phantom. Give me that dehydrator. I gotta figure out what the recipe is. One fire quartz. Okay, so that's a that's a work my way down to the mine. Here's your hot pepper. Thank you. Took you long enough. Thank you. Help. 50k, new achievement. Go to the community center, drop stuff off, and go back down into the mines. We got one keg out of it. I think once I get my money back up, I'll figure out. Uh, no, I'll do. I'll do some upgrading of some tools first, and then I'm gonna purchase a barn. I'm also gonna need to get some. Um, some heaters. 
This is getting closer to winter. Construction bundle, there you are. Charcoal kiln, which I will never use. Was it, was it this one? It's, yeah, exotic foraging bundle, there we go. Yeah, I have a cake in my inventory. Autumn's bounty. I got the cake from, um, from a bundle. Or it was the putting 2,500 into the vault. Gave me three cakes, three chocolate cakes. Imagine the different kind of Pokemon that you can use as service animals, too. Each different kind of Pokemon um, could have uh, different benefits for, for service Pokemon, too. Yeah, going grocery shopping. What if you go grocery shopping with a Pokemon that has a, uh, like an ice type Pokemon that they could keep the cold items cold for you on your journey back home? For the last time, Peach, you cannot have a, a Machoke on your dodgeball team. I didn't say that. I said practical use, not for funsies. That'd be cheating. I feel. Forgings. Gonna put that back in there. Grab. Uh. Grab some salmon berries. A bear in here. The bear will protect my headboard. Imagine a lawyer that has Mewtwo, they will always win in court. Yeah, you couldn't hide... You couldn't hide the truth from a Mewtwo. Actually, that would probably be very... If you would have psychic Pokemon as lawyers. I don't know how well that would hold up as evidence in court because it's not actually like physical evidence. Oh, you could probably utilize like Trubbish to prevent people from littering because you have like the you have them as like a face a fake trash bag. And if you see somebody littering around in that area, the Trubbish will be the one to know. You two the best prosecuting attorney. Your Honor, this is my emotional support, you two. And if you disagree with me, I don't think you will. <laughs> This is my emotional support, Giratina. I'm sorry that he takes up half of the courtroom. You can 
also use certain Pokemon for space travel too. What stops you from actually throwing the, the bones at me when you sometimes don't even throw the bones at me? I don't understand. I can literally have an Alakazam to help me cheat on my math homework because it has an IQ of like 800. <laughs> See, that's the, that's not practical. That's cheating. We don't talk about Vaporeon in this house. Is forbidden, forbidden, um, forbidden conversation. Oh, I missed the quartz there, but I gained a diamond. Ooh, two diamonds. Oh boy. I hope I don't die here. Oh my god, stop! That's too much health you're taking from me. I would think an Alakazam would be good as a tutor, but not for you to cheat on math tests. Hello. Did I finish it? One more skeleton. You could probably have a good amount of psychic Pokemon as tutors or teachers. Trying to murder me from a distance. percent of the Pokemon world never went to school. Yeah, you get homeschool. I think that would be perfectly fine. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Why did my why do I keep turning? to another section of floor down before I get the eh. guess I have guess I have that 
Yay. Gold. Which further down is it for the sword? I can't recall. Yeah, Shaven Flower Shop. That'd be cute. You could also utilize water Pokemon in in um in flower shops too. I need to I need to finish up the Pokédex in Scarlet and Violet. Who do I have to turn this into? A wizard. Oh, you heard actually. No, I'm leaving. Oh, thanks. I'm leaving. Oh, thanks. I don't want to die. I have I have four diamond in my possession. I'm leaving. Goodbye. I may not have found fire quartz, but I found other things that are far more valuable than my own life. Do you guys still have thoughts about whether or not the new Pokemon uh, game that's coming out next year is going to be set in a futuristic or past kind of setup? Or maybe a combination of the of the two. Also, I'm hyped. Apparently, it's going to be in a city. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, they're remaking the city for, what is it, black and white? Is it black and white? I think. Which one was it? Was it X and Y? I don't remember. Yeah, X and Y. Oh, yeah, because ZA. That's right. I have played X and Y. I remember, um, I remember the, the poodle dog. Have I shipped a diamond? I have shipped a diamond. I will ship one extra diamond. These are for gift giving. And to sleep. We're getting close to getting another Junimo plushie. Oh, that's a... I did not check. We're probably going to get a lot of batteries soon. Oh, we're definitely going to get a lot of batteries. Those ones too? Oh. Oh, it hit all of the lightning rods. City. 
Lum Lumios City? Luminos? All attacks deal 10% more damage. Critical strike chance increased by 50%. Mm. Critical strike. I don't know which Pokemon I would want to see get regional forms. I do know that I would very much like to have more. I want more. Um, I want more evolutions. And batteries. Yeah, my <laughs> my cat has has a leprechaun hat on. You can get that on the seventeenth in spring. start making certain things with the batteries okay I'm gonna go back down into the mines and hopefully get some fire quartz I also saw we have two things of mushrooms I need to start going down into the secret forest to get more, get more hardwood. I can also put one of these in the community bundle. It dehydrates both mushrooms and fruit. Which will also sell for more money. Flying EV type in Power World. We need we need flying, we need bug. Steel, and there's a couple others. Eevee, Eevee. Eevee, 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 Eevee. Yeah, but a bug Eevee as well. There is not a ghost uh, type Eevee. There's fire, electric, grass, ice, water, fairy, fire. A dragon type EV would be very cool too. Why if I pass the community center when I wanted to put the mushroom in? Uh, psychic and dark as well. Oh, now I just need the hazelnut. I still don't understand how how the internet ruined Vaporeon, but I'm not even going to ask, nor do I want to know, really. We're not going to have that conversation. Yeah, Umbian, um, um, Umbian, Umbreon is dark. So the... 
there would be fighting, bug, steel. If they if they're kind of if they're wanting to still go through ev like Eevee is a universal Pokemon that has every type. They need fighting, bug, dragon, um, steel. Where are the other ones? There's a cu only a couple left, really. Ghost. That was the other one. I think a ghost type EV would be very, 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 very cool. What if a, yeah, what if a fighting type EV is just a buff EV? <laughs> That's a thought. Buff Eevee. <gasps> There's the fire quartz. Give me. I need two now. Give me one additional one so I can make the dehydrator. And avoid the bats as much as I can. That Eevee break his legs. <laughs> yeah, bug, poison, steel, rock, ground, dragon, fighting, ghost, and flying. There you go. That's that's the rest of the Eevees that we need. And uh, I am pretty sure that they could come up with some pretty neat concepts for that. Oh, I got a farm totem. There's so much potential for design for a for all of those different types of EVs. Stop healing. Just stop healing. Oh my god. There we go. If you give me a moment, I will set you free. Well done, baby. I have a cat in here that wants freedom. She's actually been in here for... Oh. Oh, I didn't even know this has been about four hours. Here, right, one sec. I'm gonna free the kitty. Baby girl. I'm gonna go grab the tum tum tax. I have received the tum tum tax and the cats have exchanged places she she left he was at the door and he touched noses with her and then they traded places <laughs> oh 
Oh, it's so cute. What's funny though is that he still has the mentality that I'm gonna kick him out because I used to do that so he wouldn't get into the cords. Um, yeah, no cat cam today. He went straight underneath the bed. <laughs> he 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 thinks that I'm gonna kick him out. So he his bright idea is to go underneath the bed. So he thinks, oh, she can't get me here, so I can stay. We need a cat cam underneath the bed, but then you'll see, then you'll, that, I, I'm afraid to put the cat cam underneath the bed because what if you see my feet? What if there's a possibility that you might see my feet? Do you, do, if, if you want a cat cam, I could do this. Hold on. <laughs> there you go, cat cam. I, I put the... I have a, a I have a plush toy leaning up the up against the the shelf over there. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe Binks might get a an idea and get a cat cam under the bed. No, you get there's not enough light down there. Let's be real. If Pokemon were real, ninety percent of the biggest companies would become evil teams. They probably would. Pokemon for real, someone would definitely need to keep an Everstone on. An Everstone leash? Yes. Night Vision. Night Vision Cat Cam! That would be expensive. I need to find a way down. I don't really want to fight the slimes, but I think I probably should. Why is there a bat here? I can't fight the slime and the bat at the same time. It'll murder me. Someone wakes I No, no. How about this? I will test out possibly putting the webcam underneath the bed. Maybe. I will take a look. I make no promises. Yeah, I need extra light down there for you guys to see them. I don't think that you can turn a regular webcam into a, a, a night vision one. I don't think that's possible. Who knows, there might be a possibility that he might jump up there. I'll keep the cat cam on for now and see if there's a possibility that he might jump up. Get an under the bed disco ball? <laughs> An under the bed disco ball for a cat cam. Cat boogie cam. A for criticals. Come on, get me down to floor 85. Ah. No, I don't want to fight you. Goodness. You're the most annoying one to have a fight. There we go. Oh, that's gonna be a pain in the butt. Uh, 
That'll do. Oh, we got a crab. I don't know why the crab's not waking up. Oh, if he touches me. Oh, no. Oh, it's so annoying. Oh. The crab also be eepy. Technically, there is a cat cam off. We just don't have... <laughs> we don't have the specific cat. You got three prismatic charts before fall in my save. You've been bl you've been very blessed. I just want to get the stuff down there without dying. There we go. That's how she that actually works. Oh, what is this? <gasps> Broccoli seeds. Where's my way down? Cool, I have upgraded my mining. The only uh, thing that I got really lucky on was as soon as I opened up the quarry, um, the first iridium ore that I got on the quarry gave me the prismatic shard. I was really lucky. Cool. Ooh. Anything over here? Fire quartz. Yes, now I can make both the dehydrator and finish the bundle for the mine carts. Purple mushroom. Oh, you hit for 13. I hate you. Stop it. Stop it. Hey, maybe. It's the dehydrator. Dehydrator. Control the economy. So I think I know why I'm sick. I didn't do get to do my weekly blood sacrifice to the great snail god peach. No, that is not true. That is not how you got sick. Oh, 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 oh. Freaking, freaking crab. Cave crab. Oh, you know what? No, 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 I'm leaving. Bye-bye. I'm gonna go put... the additional fire... the fire quartz in the... in the community bundle, and then I think I'll be able to get the mine carts tomorrow. <laughs> Clearly. It's all the raw water. <laughs> I haven't found a frog pet yet. See the Nautilus shell? She's done. Yay. Mine carts. I probably shouldn't be telling you this, Swiss, but I'm drinking a Dr. Pepper and not water.
I'm drinking Dr. Pepper. I'm sorry I can't celebrate with you, Junimo. Actually, the time's not moving. Oh, no, it is. Goodbye, Junimo. I gotta go. Whee! I'm not mad, I'm just disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> what do you oh fall fall for broccoli Go to bed. Then we can get more batteries. Hello, hello, hello. Dr. Pepper is the devil's nectar. <laughs> which Pokemon do you think would fare best in the SMT universe? And which SMT character would fare best in the as a Pokemon trainer? Oh no. Um I I think any protagonist from any uh, Shimagami Tensei games would fare well as a uh, Pokemon trainer because they're all basically using demons like Pokemon in a way. Dr. Pepper was an actual doctor. I wonder if just like Coca-Cola, Dr. Pepper had some uh, medicinal qualities to it. Well, not medicinal for Coca-Cola. Some different kind of situation with that. You played that automaton mission earlier with two people higher level than me and they were terrible. <laughs> automatons are difficult, but I feel like I hate the chargers more than I hate the automatons. Remember chat, Peach demands weekly blood sacrifices for her peach baskets? No, I don't. You don't need... No, you don't need to do blood sacrifices for me. No blood sacrifices. <laughs> tomorrow, tomorrow we can get the other Junimo. Dance of the Moonlight Jellies. And get a calendar. Oh my god. Okay, what do I need to make the wood clay fire quartz? Dehydrator. Okay, first thing to put in the dehydrator. Let's try melon prize five oh five pieces interesting okay cool that's neat let's, let's put stuff back away That's kind of interesting. That requires five pieces. I wonder how much more money the dehydrator is going to make then. Coke did used to get sold at drugstores. Yeah, it it did have some things in it that that are no longer uh, required ingredient in Coca Cola. 
Uh, apparently, he loved the smell of the medicines, and he made it into drinks. So that's how Dr. Pepper soda was invented? Really? I don't feel like Dr. Pepper tastes like medicinal. The snail with a trillion dollar throat. <laughs> Aren't melons like 90% water? Yes, they are. I do like dried cantaloupe. Dried cantaloupe is del delicious. Very expensive though. So I think that most uh, dehydrated dried fruits are ex still expensive. Chicken statue. Maybe the recipe got changed? It might it might have been. I'll have to look at about the the origins of Dr. Pepper. You haven't had actual ginger? Are you talking about like pickle ginger or candy ginger? Canada Dry is 1% ginger. Oh, gi like ginger ale. I see what you mean. I... There is a brand that I used to drink. I don't... I don't know if I've seen it. Um... It was a very potent, like, ginger beer, ginger ale kind of, kind of drink. And I think the brand was called Q... Usually you find it at like health food stores. I would usually ask for that when I got sick instead of uh, Canada Dry or Schweppes ginger ale. Because I don't feel like it has a lot of ginger in it. If it if a ginger ale doesn't have a slight burn to it, it's not it's not really ginger ale. In my opinion. I like the more potent ginger ales. If you look it up and I was right, you have to drink one cup of raw water. <laughs> what are you talking about? About uh, Dr. Pepper being medicinal or. Or like the smell of medicine. I do plan to drink water after this. I just happen happen to have been drinking the Dr. Pepper along with the other half of my, uh, or while eating the other half of my Subway sandwich. I'm not making a bet when you probably already know you're right. I'll be drinking water anyway. You silly goose. You gooper. We have 10, 20 batteries in total. That's a lot of batteries. Okay. Chicken statue and then the pale ale is for Pam. I've seen the future and I'm not at an opera. <laughs> do you even rinse it before you drink it? What do you mean? What do you mean rinse it? Wonder if I should go for a shiny Hisuian Gudra or go for the normal version. Go with with whatever Gudra uh, makes your heart happy.
You don't wash your water. <laughs> oh my goodness. Ooh. You didn't see anything, Sebastian. You didn't see nothing at all. How do you wash your water? What do you mean? I don't think that uh, you can't wash your water at home. Well, no, uh, technically you can. That's called boiling it. No, not soapy water is the new drink of choice. That would lead to a tummy ache. Don't do that. Ooh, we got some iridium or... There's something off about the cat cam. I can't quite put my finger on it. <laughs> Doesn't quite look right, does it? I don't, I don't know. I don't know what you mean. I don't quite understand. Have much purple right now? Oh. I wish I could remove this bar so I can see what I'm doing. One lone purple. It's just gonna be an odd one out. Okay. Just move the bar forehead. I can't change mechanics. It's not how it works. It's not how it works at all. I can't do what I can't do. ship those. Those crystal. Okay, where's Pam at this time? Is she in the trailer? There she is. Pale ale for you, Pam. A hoppy goodness. I need to look at the... Oh, I already looked through that trash can. Oh, it's tomorrow, Dance of the Moonlight Jellies. I'm even gonna go look at the... the bookseller, because I'm poor. I can't afford it. You had a Fue Coco outbreak. That's good.
I was like, what is that? It's the cat behind the scarecrow. That startled me. I wasn't sure what that was. Cat. So that means I'm going to need five mushrooms for the dehydrator as well. I should go into the secret forest. I need my chair and my yeah the next time it rains I should also go into the secret forest to see if I can get the the um the the wood skip fish I think it's supposed to be specifically there when it's raining. You know what I just realized? I don't think that I didn't go to... I killed all those skeletons and didn't actually go to the wizard. I missed out on a thousand gold. Your cat just a Jacksepticeye accent. <laughs> That's a that would be a really neat cat. I should do for food later though I don't think that I'm actually gonna be hungry anytime soon because that sandwich felt like it was more than a foot long so it was the way that they cut it, it made it really look like it was a much longer sandwich Was a thousand gold in video games in Stardew Valley? That's actually it's a lot of money. It's it's quite a bit of money. Thankful though, or as long as I'm keeping an actual like good flow of shipping out mayonnaise and stuff, then it won't be too bad. Putting fish in the smoker, but I only have so much coal to... Or so much coal in my possession. Oh, she's already closed. That's right, you didn't actually get food at all, did you, Wisp? You still... You need to have a little bit of sustenance. To get food charcoal i feel like charcoal is a waste of of money or a waste of resources the charcoal requires five wood per per one bed of coal Oh, 
Oh. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh boy. Uh. Why does that one have to be the annoying one? Oh my god. Oh, that hurts. Oh, that hurts. Oh, my God. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Why is there? Oh, why is there so many? Oh, I'm gonna die. I have enough since 1 a.m. I'm not hungry. I'm not sleepy. Either that is concerning or I'm gonna crash like a train wreck later. I feel like that that that's a combination of both being concerned and that you're gonna you're gonna trash or crash like a train wreck. You you might you might wanna at least nibble on something. Are you are you are you drinking something? Do you have liquids? At least? Do you have crackers? Don't touch me, please. Oh my god, why? Are you getting through my defenses? You're just laying in bed with blue. Is there anybody home that can that can that can get you a snack? Oh my god, why? A health bar goes down so quickly. When was the last time you ate something in general? I know you've been up since one, but when was the last time you ate food? to get to the next floor so I can upgrade it. Otherwise, it's a waste of money. I'm so close to the next floor that I believe that I get my, my sword on. Oh, what the heck? Genie shoes! What? <laughs> and I hold on to those. Since baked potato? And you're concerned about me drinking water. And I still have some things to hydrate me. And you haven't eaten since baked potato the other day? That's not okay. If the if the the genie shoes had better defense, I would be wearing them right now. But right now, I need the, I I need all the defense I can get. Oh, 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 boy. 
Oh, that missed me. Oh, that was lucky. Any shoes. Get to floor 90 when I probably spend the entire day in the mine. And not be bombarded by 20 shadows. I should move that. That actually kind of hurts my, my ears. Put that in the corner. Maybe I still have. <laughs> uh, yeah. Maybe. I, maybe I still have a slight headache going on. <gasps> yeah, I can get. I can get my blushy tomorrow. <gasps> I gotta be over there by noon. Before noon. Flushy time. Ooh, look at the dehydrated melon. I can put the... I can put the... <laughs> hey, baby. Emily has been uh, let back into the room. My genie shoes in there. I'm gonna make sure I take care of my chickens real quick. That's my other chicken. Oh, there's my other chicken. Oh, we also have the, the jellyfish today. What are you doing? Why do you just sit? She's just sitting there. She's sitting on the floor. Just staring off into the distance. You want to go on the shelf? She's staring at me. Maybe I shouldn't even bother watering these because they're all going to be dead tomorrow. Make sure to... Tonight at around 10 o'clock p.m., a rare and beautiful event will take place. The Moonlight Jellies will be passing by Pelican Town on their long journey south for the winter. We're gathering uh, at the beach to watch. You don't want to miss this. Okay. Melon! Sell. Melons. You ordered the ratatouille? Are you door dashing food? Maybe this time I'll actually make soup today. Uh, let's put more. Let's do one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so it's just fruit 
I can put in there. And then let's put... Would tomatoes work? Oh, it's considered a vegetable. Okay, let's go stand by the bush. It was a squash. I didn't know if you could put vegetables in the dehydrator as well. I was testing it. I think it said just... Fruit or edible mushroom. Okay, so no veggies. Noon. Noon, I get my plush toy. I wonder if Emily went underneath the bed as well. I'm hoping that she jumps up on the shelf, but I don't think that she will. Because as you know... When I attempt to do the cap cam, cat, cat cam, it never follows suit. It has to be like a, a spontaneous thing. They were all out of spicy ratatouille. That's sad. I'm sorry. Maybe some uh, spicy barbecue. Oh, you got regular. Do you have spite uh any sort of spicy seasonings at home? You could spice it up yourself. She's too in intimidated by the current occupant <laughs> that stares into your soul. Just sitting there menacingly. It'd be funny if she thought that it's like, why is this cat in my space? That's not being I know I got here early, but I really want this plush. I want to fill my room with Junibo plush toys. Really? Somebody told me that there's multiple colors! They lied. They lied to me. I've been told a fib. Maybe there's a different way to get the other Junimo plush toys? I don't know. I've been... I've been lied to! Don't put the Carolina Reaper on the Ratatouille. I'm now gonna go to the forest and go talk to the, the lady in the caravan. Here you go, Emily Aqua or Amethyst for you. If I see Caroline, she's getting the aquamarine. I've been lied to about my June Ju plush. I'll have to look I'll have to look it up. Maybe there's different ways that you can get the other colors, or if there is actually other colors. I think I need 10,000 for a barn. Or is that 6,000 for the barn? Duh. Is the tilapia part of the... Oh, I already put a tilapia in. People lying on the internet? No, my friend made mention of it, but I guess it 
they have a friend that they play with. I think that they do mods, so it might be a mod thing, that, but they didn't know. I will have to look it up later. I've been checking up on my Pokemon subscription feed and there has been a lot of YouTube uh, YouTubers playing Pokemon Hide and Seek. Pokemon Hide and Seek? March Madness. Oh, maybe I should be uh, watering the corn because I think the corn goes into... Corn goes into fall. It's been an April Fool's joke. I don't think no, they I don't think that they are intentionally trying to uh thwart me. Pokemon Scarlet and Violet where you play as your Pokemon. Oh, yes. I've seen people uh, play with some sort of ball in that forum as well. Throwing a ball back and forth. Chicken mayo. Mayonnaise. Next thing on the list. Oh. We, gotta, we we really need to buy the backpack upgrade. <laughs> Once I get another another five thousand, I will get my backpack upgrade and then start upgrading uh my pickaxe again. That was mayonnaise. I thought it was a blue bucket of pain. I that's what I've been making the eggs or utilizing the eggs with. I've been making mayonnaise. Making the mayonnaise. That'd be really weird that I could be chugging a can of blue paint when you can chug the mayonnaise bottle. I'm glad I don't have to work on April Fools. It seems like a bad day to work with children. Oh no. I think it's a bad day to work in general on April Fools because there's a lot of things that could go horribly wrong. People certainly make some horrible jokes on on April 1st. There's always at least a handful of people that will do some really awful jokes that are definitely not jokes on April Fools. Touching me. Hi, please. There 
we go. I'm just spending time until 10 o'clock and then I can go watch jellyfish in the water. Oh, you think op opposite day isn't a thing? Because if it is, opposite day isn't opposite day. <laughs> See, now that hurts my brain. I was there not do anything for April Fools. Because I feel like no matter what, um, even some innocent jokes can be kind of funky. Where is my staircase down? Eh. To town? Why is everything you eat crunched like an apple? Uh, I, I, maybe it's all styrofoam and we're not actually, actually cultivating a farm. I'm not sure. I'm gonna dig around in the trash cans while I wait. Oh, oh, they almost, oh, that would have been bad. They almost saw me. This generation on April Fool's, someone's gonna, someone's gonna die most likely. I hope not. Please don't. Dance of the moonlight jellies. Hello, Marnie. That's a heavy load of people for an ancient wooden dock. I'll stay over here near the beach. I can't believe summer's over. I feel like it just started. I'm gonna take a picture of the jellies when they arrive. I want to see the rare green jelly. Life is so easy for a jellyfish, just letting the waves carry you onwards forever. Moonlight jellies, I wonder how they taste. I would never try it, of course. Are you sure about that? Uh, don't tell Gus, but I'm a little disappointed there's no buffet tonight. Hello, Caroline. These candles are romantic, aren't they? What are you selling? <gasps> Cloud decal. Star decal. Modern rug. Seafood pudding. For 5,000. I will get the jelly banner. I thought I saw something moving in there. Something big, something dark. I was trying to scare you. <laughs> he saw a mermaid. I wonder if they're poisonous. Some jellyfish are. Maybe I shouldn't push Sebastian in the water after all. Such a rare and exciting thing. Is the... Is the wizard on this side? Can I even get to this side? Oh, I can. Well, summer is over, to be honest. I'll be happy to say goodbye to these blasted mosquitoes. What are you looking at? Or why are you looking at me like that? You think I'm too old to enjoy something like this? Sir, you're grumpy all the time. I'm not sure you really enjoy much of anything. Or truly. I remember seeing the jellies once as a little girl. Oh, how I jumped with joy when they arrived. Oh, there's more. That was a long time ago. She's a lot less energetic. Speaking of the only time I might go near the beaches in Florida for the glowing neon in the water. 
Oh, the the one with the um. Oh God, was it glowing plank? I don't know if it's glowing plankton or if it's something else. It's kind of cold, actually. I guess fall is right around the corner. Oh, I wonder if we get to see their winter-ish attire in fall, too. The Moonlight Jelly, what a remarkable species. We're very lucky that they stop here on their long journey south. It's unknown why they're attracted to light. Very curious. Did you see that candle boat? I crafted it myself. Where's the wizard? I don't see the wizard. Yeah, I'm paying my respects to another bygone summer. There's no wizard this time. Oh, there he is. How did you find me back here? I thought it was well hidden. Perhaps you are bless, uh, blessed with the gift of clairvoyance. I'm here to observe the Luna... Luna loose or moonlight jellies, as you call them. They possess an unusually pa uh, potent magical aura for an aquatic life form. Hmm. I think you'll be okay along the shoreline. I hope there are babies this year. Uh, the jellies were here a year ago and they'll be back again a year from now. And nature is amazing. Most night fish would be scared of the lights. Uh, these are strange ones. There, I just saw something glowing. Oh, it's gone. Look out there at the endless sea, deep underwater. All kinds of life forms are moving around in the dark. Eerie, isn't it? I don't like you saying that, Emily, with that specific facial expression. That just makes it so much more eerie than it is. I wore my special shoes tonight. No one noticed. Oh my goodness, Clint. If we keep polluting the oceans, the jellies will surely go extinct. It's already in the process of happening. What a shame. We have no respect for nature anymore. You got that right. Okay. Okay. Good evening, Peach. The moonlight jellies are close. I already saw one glowing in the distance. Uh, once we launch, uh, launch the candle boat, they'll come up to the docks and say hello. Ready. Yay. This is a... This is a good way to end the stream, too. Finish it with the moonlight jellies. On into autumn. We've been going for nearly five hours now. I feel sorry for Clint. Poor, th uh, poor thing needs some therapy. I'm gonna go ahead and Kate take the cat cam down. No cat cam for today. Maybe maybe I'll try to coax one of them onto the onto the shelf next time I stream. Look how cute. And there's the green jelly. I think you can see mermaids in in Stardew as well by that. By that uh, big stone off to the, the left hand side. The glow of summer has faded now and the moonlight jellies carry on towards the great unknown. Jellyfish. I can put a banner in my house. Oh, no. Did 
fish. My cat somewhere. Okay, I already got those. It's pretty, but it won't talk me into going near the ocean. No, that's completely fine. You have your you have your reasons. Gonna remove this. Put that down. Jellyfish. I almost forgot to get the bread. Holy monkey. Okay, that's very lucrative. Almost 2,000 just for five things of melon. Yeah, we're going to have to we're going to have to utilize that more. That's a good way to get money. Oh my goodness, the dehydrator is awesome. Look at all my crops. Eh. Take care of that next time. We're going to end it for today. Melons! Melons are really lucrative. Save your melons for the dehydrator. You get nearly 2,000 gold for it. That's amazing. Oh, that makes getting money so much uh, easier. Save all fruit and um, and mushrooms for the dehydrator unless you're using the fruit to make wine. I wonder what dehydrated uh, star fruit would, how much that would be compared to selling star fruit wine. I wonder if I can dehydrate the fruit or the sweet gem berries. Ooh, that would be cool. We can finally plant our, our our berries too next time. We might be doing more Stardew Valley tomorrow. Possibly. Buy peach, have some tasty dirt. I'm not going to eat dirt. I might eat soup though. Starfruit wine sounds good. It does, doesn't it? I haven't had a starfruit in a very long time. The last one that I had was kind of tart, but it was very, very delicious. Um, I'll see you guys probably tomorrow. Um, we're going kind of off the off schedule for the week this time. Um, I will definitely see you guys on Saturday, though, for Princess Peach Showtime. Um... I still have been feeling kind of funky. So stream may or may not happen tomorrow, but we'll see. I'll let you guys know like later on in the day or or sometime tomorrow. You'll probably you'll see it pop up on there. Just check YouTube. You'll see it. The loading screen? What? What about the loading screen? Thanks for the stream and see you later. Yeah. Princess. Uh, did I say loading screen? I don't know. Um. You know, we'll, we'll probably play uh, Princess Peach Showtime on Saturday. And I'll take proper precautions once more, drama mean and everything. And hopefully we won't get cursed again that the uh that the internet and the power will stay on. And I will be able to properly play more than two hours of of Princess Peace Showtime. <laughs> I'm going to go continue dying. I hope that you feel better, Webs. I hope that you'll be on the men soon rather than continuing to suffer with a hundred degree fever. The Princess Peach Showtime loading screen makes you 
makes you sick you said no, it does kind of the it's like the frame rates drop on the loading screen which kind of also makes it funky but her going from still to running also kind of jerks the camera which makes it a little bit funky it's okay as long as I take a uh, Dramamine at an appropriate time and make sure that I have like peppermint oil and peppermint to eat and all that kind of stuff and then I'll be I'll be fine I didn't say woo-woo. That's not what caused the issue this time. I may have been a uh, making some angry noises, but I don't think woo-woo came out um, at that time frame when I was trying to decorate a cake. But anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Uh, if I do stream tomorrow, uh, you will see the uh, either like a post on Twitter and then the uh, stream rating, rating, waiting room will uh, be up. Either or, just check YouTube. You'll find it. I hope you all feel better. Uh, Wisp, I hope that you go into a comatose state after eating food and sleep a long time and catch up on some sleep. Webs, I hope you feel better. If there's anybody else who's sick, I hope you feel better soon. If you're going out to work soon or going to bed, have a, have a good night. Have a good day. Sleep well when you go to sleep. Have good dreams. Take care of yourself. I'll see you next time. Goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye.